The expression fourth root of 81 x to the eighth y to the sixth is equivalent to. So this question is really asking whether or not you are comfortable converting or going in between from radical form to exponential form. That's all this question is asking for. So if you can understand what the question is, you know, really trying to assess you on, then you will have a better idea of how to approach it. So looking at this right now, fourth root is the same thing as uh, the expression raised to the one fourth power. So I'm going to write, rewrite this expression as 81 x to the x to the eighth y to the sixth to the power of one fourth. And the next thing I'm going to do is I will apply the power rule for exponents. So in the power rule, uh, what happens is the exponents gets distributed over products. Exponents do not get distributed over addition or subtraction. They do get distributed over multiplication or division. So this becomes 81 to the 1 4th, x 8th to the 1 4th, 8 times 1 4th, right? And then y to the 6th times 1 4th. So that 81 there had a power to 81 to the first, right? So it's really 1 times 1 fourth if you want to think about it like that. Okay, so the next thing we're going to do is we're going to try and reduce this. So I, I notice right here that 81 there is really the same thing as 3 to the fourth. So I change 81 to 3 to the fourth and then to the 1 fourth. X to the... 8 to the x to the 8 times 1 fourth, that's really the same thing as 8x to the second. And then y to the power of 6 times 1 fourth, well, that's just 3 over 2. And if I rewrite this a little further, this becomes 3 to the first, or just 3, x squared, y to the 3 halves. So that's the answer. And that looks like it is option one.